What's up, family? I asked this question before and didn't really get a lot of feedback. And I don't ever really get a lot of feedback on it, but I'm going to ask it again. And maybe I'm asking the wrong people. Maybe that's the reason why I'm not getting any feedback. But the question is, should former Africans in America who have been incarcerated form their own nation? I'm going to frame it a different way. Should black people in America who are called felons, who've been to prison or who have a felony record, should they get together once they've been reformed or once they've changed their lives around? Should they start their own nation? And the reason why I ask is because as a convicted felon, you just about lose all your rights based on what the 13th Amendment says, 14th, the 15th. You're not really even a citizen anymore. So why are you staying here? There's probably two or three million so-called convicted felons in this country. So why are you still busting your ass every day trying to find a job, trying to work, trying to fit in, trying to blend in? When you can really just take the skills, the knowledge, and the resources you have and petition this government, petition the United Nations, if what have you, and just formulate your own government somewhere else. That's a question. And I want to answer. Peace.